Hey guys, Fury91, and I'm talking about Black Friday. Yes, that's right. I'm already talking about Black Friday. It's October 20th, and Walmart has already revealed Black Friday deals. Why? Because they're doing it differently this year. And I gotta say, my mother was right, because when I heard that Walmart was doing it differently, I'm like, how are they gonna do that? Like, how could they do Black Friday online and stuff? But I gotta say, Walmart, God's blessing, they got a very unique way to do Black Friday this year. Okay, they're doing day deals for days. Now, Best Buy did something similar. And apparently the deals for days is like from November 4th, November 7th, November 11th, November 14th, November 25th, and November 27th. So they have like six days, it seems like, where they're doing deals. Now these ones are available from Wednesday, November 4th. We got the 4K on 65 inch Ultra HD Roku TV. We got the regular 1080p FHD Roku TV TV, 42 inch for 88 bucks. That's a pretty good deal. All right, let's move on. Now, over here, we got some laptops. I'm honestly not much of a laptop gamer anymore. I had a gaming laptop, and I still have it, actually, and it still works after about, wow, was it 2011? So it still works like nine years later, thank the Lord. But these look pretty good. And for any of you guys looking for gaming laptops, these may be the days. And then we have over here this Acer 32-inch curve gaming monitor. It's 165. 8Z, 1MS, and it's 1080p though. That's just telling you, this is not a 4K monitor. Still probably a pretty good price for a 32-inch gaming monitor. Man, those pancakes look good. <laughs> and moving on, now that's all the real gaming deals for that day that you may have saw some other deals that you like, but here is the next set of deals. Now this is another good one, 55-inch 4K T TCL Roku Smart TV for 148, and 50-inch on for 128. Personally, for 20 more bucks, I'd probably go with 55 inch. But in any case, this, these are smart TVs. They are 4K televisions. Apparently, they're going to announce a third wave later on. Maybe that will have the game deals on it. But these, this is really cool way to do it, I got to admit. Because all these days, the 4th, the 7th, the 11th, the 14th, the 25th, the 27th, apparently, like, they're going to start online and go in store. So this is a really good way to do it for black friday in my opinion and hopefully the other stores follow suit now Best buy did something similar last year where i think for the first for like two weeks before black friday they were having like certain black friday deals available online every day like different ones so so hopefully best buy will do that again and hopefully that target and all the other ones will follow suit i mean target and Walmart have rain now so they're not gonna be open on thanksgiving this year so hopefully all of them are gonna be following suit and actually i gotta say if this works, I want them to continue this. I know they're only probably doing it like this this year because of what's going on in the world right now, but if this works, I tell you, this could be something that really catches on because I like how different deals are available on different days and like they're available online first and then they're available in store later. Now, one thing I hope doesn't happen is bots. I could see people with bots getting the whatever, the TVs, the laptops whatever and then selling them for like a hundred dollars more like after they get them all offline but i'm not sure if that'll happen because the thing is that they also have days to get these in store it looks like i'm not sure but it's but based on here because it says in store november 14th 5 a.m local um to me that means that you know they may actually have them available in store like these same deals like they may only have a certain amount available online and then when those are gone, you got to go to the store for it. So hopefully bots don't completely take advantage of this. But I like what Walmart is doing here. It's smart and makes sense with what's going on in the world. God bless them. And we'll see how it works. And like I said, if this works well, I'd like them to continue this. Even when all this stuff that's going on in the world is done with, God willing, I would like Walmart to continue this if this really sells. But what do you guys think about how Walmart is doing Black Friday this year? And did you see anything you'd be like waiting online? I mean, on your computer, not on the actual Black Friday line to get? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching my lecture. Subscribe me. God bless you all.